Here's how you can use Google Sheets plus a connection to Google Search Console to create a line chart that shows the average click-through rate by organic search result position for your website. So the first thing we're going to do in Google Sheets here is go to our add-ons menu. And I previously installed a free add-on called Search Analytic for Sheets. And this is what connects Google Sheets to Google Search Console. We're going to open the sidebar. And then we'll select one of our verified sites here. And for grouping, we'll group by query and page. And then click on request data. And this can take up to 30 seconds because it's pulling in up to 10,000 rows. So once the data has been pulled in, we can close the sidebar. And I'm going to insert a new column to the left here so we can get a rounded position. I'll just call it rounded position. And then use the round formula. And then what we'll do is copy this and select the entire column and paste. We'll remove our decimal here and then pivot on these two columns. So we'll select the two columns, create a pivot table. And then in the pivot table, We'll add a field to the row and we'll use rounded position. And then for values, we'll use a calculated field, which we'll call average CTR. And we'll just call this average CTR and summarize by custom. We'll then change this to a percentage. And then we'll select the first 20 positions. Once we've selected those, we'll insert a chart. And then we'll move this chart to its own sheet. We'll edit the chart and go into customize. And in chart style, we'll smooth the curve. And in series, we'll select data labels. Now what we can see specific to our website is our average click-through rate by Google organic search results position. This shows our drop-off rate as we move from position one to position two to position three, etc. In another video, we'll show some ways you can use the data from Google Search Console to move more results up the left-hand part of the curve.